You've probably heard that planets revolve around the sun, but not in perfect circles. They move in elliptical orbits. That's exactly what Kepler's first law says. To better understand this, imagine two nails fixed on a surface with a string tied between them. If you keep the string tight with a pencil and trace around it, you'll draw an ellipse. Geometrically, an ellipse is the set of all points, where the sum of the distances to two fixed points, the foci, is always the same. In the case of the solar system, the sun occupies one of these foci. When a planet is closest to the sun, it's at perihelion. When it's farthest, it's at aphelion. But hold on, this ellipse is exaggerated. It looks more like a comet's orbit. That's because its eccentricity, the measure of how stretched out it is, is very high, close to one. In reality, most planets have orbits with low eccentricity, so much so that they almost look like perfect circles. So remember this, a planet's orbit is an ellipse with the sun at one of the foci. That's Kepler's first law.